Oh, well, as usual, software never sleeps. Uh, so we're continuing to add new features, new versions. The great thing about when a customer makes a purchase from Synergy Software is that they can then keep that current. So we can sell a piece of software 10 years ago and bring that story forward for people in ways that 10 years ago, no one will even have had an idea of what features we might have needed uh, then, but we can keep that current and keep iterating that. So as usual, uh, you know, the factory has been working hard, churning out new pieces of software to uh, add support for new IP projects protocols, big exciting ones, things like SRT, which is taking the industry by storm uh, and makes really interesting use cases. So we're seeing a lot of people interested in that. And of course that keeps us really busy because we've got to write this stuff, test this stuff, integrate this stuff, uh, and then promote it. <laughs> I think the great thing that software defined television brings is it brings flexibility. So today's broadcaster, today's customer, they don't know what their industry is going to look like realistically in two, three, four years time. So you don't want to be making investments that have got a four or five year payoff window when you don't know what your business will need to react to. Uh, the great thing about having a, a software oriented approach is you can make an investment in some generic IT equipment or in the cloud and then you can adapt to what you need. So if, if you need uh, extra capacity for a World Cup event this year and then you need some special Christmas pop-up channels and then you need Olympics, you can make that happen you can react to that if you need to build new channels uh, increase capacity reduce capacity in just one day play out tomorrow that's where software divine television really lends itself to that so you can uh, kind of take a pool of resources and move them around uh, so that's where making an investment in synergy technology and in synergy equipment uh, any equipment to run synergy on rather uh, then you keep that business flexibility to meet what you need uh, in any given period but also because of the way that we continue to update software products we don't kind of say here's product x and replace it with product y in three years time we keep that that life cycle alive it means that an investment you make today keeps just getting ever more relevant as you move forward through time and as you need to adapt your business. Oh, so I think it, it is evolution. Uh, I think all these things, the change creeps up on you. If I look back at where we were as a company and where the industry was you know, eight or nine years ago when I started with Synergy, uh, it's, it's so different to, to where anyone would have expected, but it's changed a huge amount. So I think the most important thing is to remain agile. Uh, so as you, as a business, need to do things, you need to make sure that you're ready to adapt with the changes. I don't see any big, like, snap, everything changes moments. Uh, if you look at the adoption of technology, that often uh, happens by like a pilot area and then growing out. Uh, so, you know, whether that's ever evolution or revolution, it, it, it blurs a bit. But uh, the most important thing is to maintain that flexibility, maintain that adaptability, uh, and therefore be the ones that survive. So I suppose that means evolution. So uh, SRT for me, it, it opens up a big collection of use cases, of, of user stories, of uh, practical uses of the software that, that really is coming of age. So the eight, nine, 10 years ago, people wanted to do more stuff in the cloud, but the internet connectivity just wasn't generally there. Now it's much easier to just expect 100 megabits of internet connectivity wherever you go as a minimum. So all of a sudden you're freed from the constraints of, of, of where things are. SRT is just an extra piece of magical glue that lets you break those chains of where am I putting something here, where am I putting something there. You don't need to really think that hard about it now. You just know that the technology's got your back uh, to make sure that your signal can travel from wherever it might be to wherever you need it to be and to do that in a secure and reliable manner. Uh, so for us, we always had uh, pieces of software that could go anywhere, but the problem with it, with SDI was then you had to plug a cable in, and that's a problem. Uh, and then we've been pioneers of IP, but then that was always on like well curated gigabit lands, uh, you know, the way that uh, these these protocols want it to be, and, and that's limiting. And so when you combine SRT, you you take the handcuffs off that, and all of a sudden you're free to then say, cool, I can put this where my business needs it to be, be that in the cloud on some rented virtual machines uh, or on a data center in a different site to where you actually have uh, a camera or a, a monitor screen. And so it, it's a massive liberator. So when you then start designing systems, designing solutions, looking at what you want to do to make the business need get delivered, 
you've just got a, a, an amazing uh, re reduction in concern and complexity about where will I put it, how will I move it, it's it just gone. Uh, and then it opens up just other fun things, like uh, I now can just pop open Synergy's Multiviewer on my mobile wherever I want to go, cool, I just click open streaming, uh, and, and that's just also liberating. Uh, so yeah, it's a really fun time to have these tools available, and because it's baked right in, there's no, oh, do I have a license for that? Have I got the subscription? What was my bandwidth? Do I, uh, uh, have I, have I paid enough for that bandwidth to run? It's just, it's just part of it, just click on. Uh, and again, like when you look at what's been popular across the industry, things like the iPhone were popular because there's the, that lack of friction. Uh, as it was put down to, you know, if you take the friction away from the problem, then customers adopt it much better. So for me, having it built right in the product, so it's there, included in the license, just ready to go, removes a big block of friction, uh, makes the planning easier, makes the cost planning easier, makes deployment easier, because you can just rely on it being just there. Uh, so yeah, that, I'm really excited about it because it just, it, it takes off shackles to you know, find other words for handcuffs, having used handcuffs already. Uh, it's like just a minute. Uh, so, uh, so yeah, it, it's incredibly powerful and, and we've got customers that are incredibly excited about having this.